You know, we're going to talk about now the card of the week. Oh, is that That's perfect? We're, ju- we're doing All it. Right. All right. We're, we're doing the card of the Sponsored week, guys. Sponsored by Diet Coke. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can't say that. I don't uh, want to. Uh, no, we're, I was just we're just memeing. We're memeing, guys. We're memeing, guys. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm going to have Jim talk about this card. Okay. okay. So Jim actually um, had the idea of having a card from this game. Okay. Yeah. For the card of the week. Okay. And he wanted to talk about another card, and I'll ex- I'll let him explain why he wanted to talk about this other card, okay? But for the first card yeah, this of this game, we we're like, all right, this kind of is a yeah. better one just to talk about, okay? <laughs> so, Jim, just you, you take it away. You okay. take, take it away and go with okay. it. Okay. All right. Let's talk about this card. Yep. So there is a game that we've played called Dice Throne. I was it's about to call right it. There. Yeah, this, right there. Yeah. Right there. These two games with the, with the die on them. Yeah. Um, the so, dice that's on fire. Yeah. So uh, how it's played is you you have this character and they all have different abilities. So, and you roll these dice and d- depending on what it is that you roll, uh, you get to use these abilities, right? And inside the game, there's also these cards that can manipulate the dice or power up your abilities. There's, you know, there's a few things you can do. And it's so- a, It's an asymmetrical game. Meaning okay. each 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 character is different. Yes, they're all different characters with their unique yes. unique cards, unique sets of abilities. Mm-hmm. Um, each has their own set of dice, so every character is different from one another. Yeah. However, they do share some cards. Yeah. So uh, with with the card that we were going over, uh, or should I talk about the card that I wanted? Talk about to go let's over? let's talk about this one first. All right, we'll talk, talk about, about this, this one, one first. So wild! This card is so wild, honestly. For <laughs> <laughs> For two cost, right? This is an instant speed card, I believe. Yes, it is. Roll phase action. Yes, oh, it's, it's instant it's, speed, though. Okay, okay. Yeah, you can't use it anytime, but yeah, you can you use can, it anytime during roll during phase. During a roll phase, yep. yeah. Yep. It, it says, change the value of any one die. Mm-hmm. Change the value of any one die to anything yeah. that you want. Yeah. Any die to yeah. anything. Yeah. So you so, could use this. To benefit yourself, yeah, or what I like to use it for, yeah, to hinder Dan, <laughs> yes, correct, or correct. anyone else, really. correct. I use it as, a, a, yeah, as a debuffer. <laughs> it's like, oh, Dan's like, dude, I'm, I'm ready. I'm about to destroy someone, I got and all I'm sixes. like, <laughs> yeah. oh, wait, no, no, no. I don't think. Are you able to augment ultimate? No. Oh, uh, I don't remember. I can't remember. I can't remember. Or you can't stop it. Wait, no, no, no. I think okay. I think you're able. This bypasses that's the only it. Thing, yeah. yeah. I think that's the only. You have thing to you're literally to change the die. Yeah. Or yeah. the dice on yeah. them to where yeah. yeah. If you're gonna ultimate, and I'm like no. Yeah. And Dan's like, I got it too though. So yeah. I'm gonna do it again. Yeah. Um. So yeah, this this card allows you to be playing either proactively or defensively, mm-hmm. which is. Which is huge, especially at instant speed we, when we, everything we, matters. We've talked about versatility many times before yes. on this. Yeah. Versatility is huge. Yeah. And two cost is actually pretty cheap. That's not terrible. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's it's not, not a lot. That's not bad. For for the power that it has. Yeah. Yeah. Is, is so cheap. for for a game that is a mix of uh uh cards and dice. Yeah. Okay. When like yes, you're using these cards, right? RNG. But, <laughs> but yeah, like you have that RNG of the dice roll. Yeah. The ability to just flat out change the value of any die is yep. freaking insane. Yep. You could go from doing literally nothing to winning the game. Yeah. Yeah. Real quick. Yep. So yep. Um yeah, this card's super powerful. I believe this is in like every single deck, I think or so. Some variant, yeah, I, be- I believe so. I believe that card is in just about every character. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's definitely one of the most powerful cards in the entire game. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah. I-, I would agree. I'd agree. Yeah. So the card that I wanted to go over, yeah. uh, they so these two right here are just like I guess you could say the base sets. Yeah, it's season, season one, season, season one, two. and season two. Right. Then right. they came their out, own characters. Yeah. Then they came out with a Marvel edition of it. Mm-hmm. They have Spider Man, Miles Morales, Black Widow, Thor, Loki. Uh, Loki uh, who are the other two? Black Panther. Black Panther. Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Those are those are the yeah. There's only six, or is it? Eight? I believe there's only. Oh man. There no, might, I think there there well, there I might be eight. eight. I think there's eight. I think there's eight. Oh, now I don't remember. It's, a, it's actually. The, oh, Doctor Strange is another one. Doctor Strange. Who who else did we say? <laughs> I don't know. There's one missing. There's there's one missing. Uh, I'll find it. All right. Regardless. Continue. Um, when we when we were playing it. I got to play as Black Widow, mm-hmm. and Black Widow, guys, is a monster, okay? Uh, she has this one ability. Uh, that, she's literally insane, guys. Yeah, she's, she's literally <laughs> broken. I'm not lying. Uh, she has these, at the start of the game, she gets Scarlet three. Witch. 
Oh, Scarlet Witch. Yeah, Scarlet Witch. Yeah. Uh, at the start of the game, she gets three covert ops, and that allows her to activate by pitching one, and you get to activate, look at the top three cards, and if there is no... No, if there There's is... No Okay, yeah. If there's no upgraded abilities in there, you can go search for one and put it into your hand. Correct. Yes. 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 And then, uh, but the other one is if there is a an upgrade in there, then you can put them back in any, any order, order that yeah. you want. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, so then that way it makes it to where it's like, all right, next turn I can draw that card that I needed. Mm -hmm. Right. So the card that I want to go over buffs that passive. Mm -hmm. So it makes it to where... You still have those three covert ops, but whenever you play a hero or an ability upgrade, you now get to draw a card. So let's say after the first time that you search for your upgraded covert or your upgraded passive ability, Red Room Training, I think is what yeah, it's called. Yeah, Red Room Training. Yeah. Uh, once you upgrade that, and now you still have two more. So in your next turn and on the next turn, you can go search for another one. So now you're deck thinning. Yeah. And then when you play it, you now draw a card. Yeah, yeah. So it's now just taking a sw And not to mention, you start your turn drawing a card. So yeah. now you're drawing two cards, deck then in by one in between. Yeah. And the, the card is just stupidly broken because you get three of those covert ops at the start. And if there's the off <laughs> chance, Dan, the off chance that you open up with the Red Room Training upgrade. And yeah. you drop that, and then you're like, now I got three covert ops. I'm going to deck them three times, you know, throughout the course of the game, and then draw three. Well, that could be more than three cards that you're drawing because all your other ones that you could be getting, yeah. all the <laughs> upgrades. Yep. And so after you have it, there's seven more upgrades that you could do. So that's going to be drawing you a bunch of assuming cards. It was assume, assuming you had a. Uh Assuming you have the resources to play those cards from hand. Yeah. But with Covert yeah. Ops, you could spend one of those to play one of those from your hand for yeah. free. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So it, it's it's another way to just be like getting free uh, stuff. Yeah. 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 It's pretty um, nuts. Black Widow is was broken. <laughs> we came to the conclusion early on that mm -hmm. Black Widow was busted. Or let's say you get the nuts, right? You you get rid of a covert ops. Uh, to play the red room for free, oh, yeah. right? Or you pay the two to play. I forget how much the upgrade is. I and think, then I think it was two. I can't remember. And then you could play another one the same turn to then be able to draw a card or mm -hmm. then play it for free. Yeah, it's it's so stupid for Black Widow, right? As mm -hmm. a whole, mm -hmm. um, and I I just wanted to go over how broken it is. But as a first and as as a game as a whole. So wild is uh, yeah, so definitely, wild is good. and so wild yeah. is inside the uh, the Black Widow deck as well. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. yep, so wild is a very good card in all of Dice Throne. Yeah, um, if you haven't yet, um, we did an unboxing of Marvel Dice Throne over on our oh, YouTube yeah. channel. You can go check that out if you want. Um, but uh, Mar we we streamed actually, we did stream us playing that game Yo, twice. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, yeah, I played Scarlet Witch the first time. I hated it. And then I played. Oh yeah. Then you played <laughs> Black, uh, Widow. Black Widow, and then I think I played Scarlet Witch the second time. Uh, you I played think. Loki. I played Loki. I played Loki one of the times. Oh, oh wait, I played Loki yeah, and you're... Doctor Strange. I played yeah, Loki yeah. and Doctor Strange. Yeah. That's what it was. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if you want to check, if you want to check out some gameplay, you can go check that out when oh, we yeah, streamed we it. Those, we got that vod. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, nice. so that was a lot of fun. But yeah. Uh, yeah, so So Wild is this week's card of the week. We got a another card from a different game. 